Despite an ongoing recount in Florida's Senate and gubernatorial races, Republicans are claiming they won and the recount should be stopped, which is exactly what happened in the 2000 election. So why does this keep happening in Florida? Here to talk about it is Broward County native and one of our writers, Allie Horde, everybody. Thanks, Seth. Uh, so why is Florida always at the forefront of election controversies? Short answer, Florida is hell in a swamp. <laughs> which I'm allowed to say because I grew up there, specifically Fort Lauderdale, which was founded by a drunk possum at a wet t-shirt contest. <laughs> now, I know what you're thinking, but Allie, you're from Florida and you don't seem too bad. Wrong. I'm terrible. <laughs> I had a belly button ring and lost my virginity on a trampoline. <laughs> Allie, I feel like we're getting away from the recount. <laughs> oh, right, the recount. Okay. The recounts happened because of negligence, corruption, and general stupidity in Broward County. For instance, a high percentage of Broward residents didn't vote for senator this year because, according to them, the ballots were too confusing. You know, like shaving or sleeves. <laughs> it also didn't help that some poll workers just left boxes of ballots at the polling locations, like post offices, schools, and Hooters, <laughs> which in some parts of Florida are the schools. <laughs> I actually graduated from Hooters High on Old Dixie Highway. We were the fighting owls. <laughs> I'm kidding. Our mascot was a breast. Allie, the recount. Oh, right, okay. So how will Florida handle this recount? Not great. In 2000, the Supreme Court stopped it and gave Bush the win because Florida was taking too long. Of course it was. We are old and slow in Florida. The Florida State bird is a pelican in a wheelchair. <laughs> And now, the same thing is happening again. Officials gave Florida a recount deadline of Thursday, which they definitely won't make. And even worse, the deadline for military absentee ballots is Friday. So they're just not going to count those ballots. If democracy wasn't a concept, Florida would roll it up and smoke it. <laughs> and these recounts never bode well for Democrats, because Republicans are very good at using bad faith arguments to claim certain ballots just don't count. Remember hanging chads? Gay clubs in Fort Lauderdale are still getting a lot of mileage out of that one. <laughs> this year, however, the big excuse for throwing out ballots is something called signature mismatch, which I don't even get because most signatures in Florida are just spilled barbecue sauce. <laughs> so if I can leave you with one thing, it's that Florida is a mess, the people are confused, and the system is corrupt. Don't hold your breath that Democrats will get any justice because the only justice in Broward County is Rick Justice, an exotic dancer at LaBear's Mail Review on Oakland Park Boulevard. Get $5 off the cover charge with the code word trampoline.